I do not like using this tool. Pittsburgh valve spring compressor. So we're putting some struts on a 17 Maxima and uh, they said there wasn't no quick struts available. So we got some OE Spectrum. Got the little seven millimeter hex there. Turn that. Let your strut come out. So I've already got this uh, spring collapsed because I was waiting on the mounts. And it just hooks around the spring there. Got these little safety pins. But I do not like using it. Don't even really feel safe using it. But our machine over here, the foot wasn't big enough for the spring. So I couldn't use that. And I barely got this done one here. And of course, now this strut is not even, the shaft is not even out enough. So I'm going to have to compress that spring some more. To be honest with you, I'm afraid that all thread bolt there is going to strip out and uh, and pop. That's what I'm worried about. All right, just for safety, I'm going to put the old strut back through there. put this nut back on this mount here. While I tighten the compressor, spring compressor tool down a little bit more with a 24 millimeter just as a safety. Goodness. Still not enough. Hmm. All right, my safety net is gone. Ah, oh, 
Getting close. That nut is not even on there through all its threads. That cannot be right. Let's see what's the one looks like on the car. Yeah. See how that comes all the way up through there? On the other side. So, the mount must be made different. Let me open up that other mount. Yeah. See that big, big spacer tacked in there? This one don't have one. It's just a thin piece of metal. So this mount's not gonna work. Cause there's no way I can send that out of here with four threads holding it together. No way. But anyways, I just wanted to say how much I dislike using this Harbor Freight strut spring compressor. Okay, so this little spacer it's just got three little bitty spot welds. So I just knocked that out of there with an air hammer. So, and other than that, they look identical. So I assume that's gonna be all right. All right, so how many people, how many of y'all have used one of these Harbor Freight specials? And how safe do you feel when you're using it? All right, thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great day.